I don't think concrete is going to be the only extruded product. Mm -hmm. I think we're, we'll start seeing uh, there's uh, at least one U.S. university working on some wood fiber and additive extrusions that, that you could potentially feed through the same sort of system. You probably need different pipes and stuff, but the fundamentals will remain the same. So I think that's going to happen. And then I think we'll, we'll see uh, we'll see the technology scale. So Cobot already has their XL printer that they have down in, in Rochester, that GE partnership. So already you're, at least one company has said, okay, we're, we're doing this on a house size, now let's do it on an apartment building size. And apartments were not the impetus for, for the XL printer, it was the windmill bases, but it's not hard to see other companies looking at that or, or coming up with their own ideas and, and scaling it to the place where it is apartment buildings, maybe mid-rise, maybe not skyscrapers yet, but but certainly the mid-rise ones. Yeah, it's an interesting idea using that base and then maybe putting housing inside of it or something. Uh, circles are very efficient.